I recently published the book Play to Potential, published by Penguin, where I talk about the notion of playing to our full potential, where I lay out a framework that can help us lead a multidimensional life. I thought I'll take you through the various iterations of the book cover that we went through, because in a way, what we're trying to capture through the book cover is the essence of the book. The first option we considered when we thought about the book cover was that of a Venn diagram, because I truly felt life is often at the intersection of two things. It's not about either or, but it's about making the and possible. But very soon we got some feedback that it doesn't quite capture what we want to communicate through the book. The next option we considered was that of a tightrope, because we felt a lot of things are like walking a tightrope, driving performance while maintaining health, solving for time and money, balancing passion and purpose, and so on. But when we asked for feedback on the tightrope, a lot of people said that this sort of suggests a certain level of nervousness as we walk through life. Playing to potential should be a joyful experience. So the next one we considered, we tried to amplify the word play, because I do truly believe that we all need to figure out when we are in flow or when we are in play, and then do more of it, and hopefully through that discover our potential. As one of my guests said, we can't work to our potential; we can only play to our potential. Somehow, that again didn't quite capture the nuance and the complexity we wanted to communicate through the book. And I remember I was having dinner with my wife and kids one day, and we were discussing the various cover options. I was taking them through my thinking, and my wife looked at me and said, "Have you thought about juggling?" It took me by surprise. Back in 2000, I used to be living in London, and I remember one particular evening quite vividly. I'd gone to Covent Garden with my friends to watch a juggling performance, and somehow, in the heat of the moment, I was so awestruck that I walked to the performer and I said, "I want to learn juggling." It's something that I hadn't thought of. It was very spur of the moment kind of a thing. He invited me to his shop, Odd Balls, in Camden Town, and over the next six months, I would go every weekend, and he'd give me homework for the next week, and I would practice and come. And over those six months, I learned many three-ball juggling tricks, which I can even do today. So my wife reminded me of the skill I have in juggling, and said, "Playing to potential is actually about juggling various identities we carry. So why don't you make the cover that? How we juggle different hats that we wear to lead a full life." And that's brought us to the cover that you see today, the various hats being juggled, and that's what we mean by playing to potential. Finally, we all need to be aware of the various identities we carry. I'm a son. I'm a husband. I'm a father. I'm a coach. I'm a podcaster. Now I'm an author. How do I really balance these various identities and lead a full life? If you're curious to know how, I would urge you to pick up the book, which is available in all offline and online outlets. The link below in the description section gives you the details where you can find the book. Thank you for listening.